My name is Frederick McWilfred. I work at the Ministry of the Presidency. And we are tasked with organizing this activity here today. It's called Bringing Government to the People. As far as they're concerned, these are just publicity stunts. Publicity stunts. I don't know how long you people are going to wait for land in this country. They're land. land. What up, Bradley does? Welcome back to my channel. Today we are in Georgetown at the Square of the Revolution where there is a large gathering of Guyanese to meet with the various ministries of the government of Guyana. So the government of Guyana is making itself available today to meet with the people of Guyana to address their concerns and so the various ministers and the ministries are present. Today we're going to try and talk with some of the people online waiting to have a meeting with the various ministries to see what in fact brought them here, what are their concerns. As you can see there are about over a thousand, perhaps five thousand people already gathered and it's only ten o'clock in the morning. We'll find out exactly what they plan to or expect to achieve being here today and whether this in fact is somehow related to the current state of the, the elections in Guyana. So stay tuned. This is my, this is my, this is my day. I'm ready to take it on, come what may. Come for numbers at My name is Frederick McWilfred. I work at the Ministry of the Presidency and we are tasked with organizing this activity here today. It's called Bringing Government to the People. Actually, it's not a new, it's not a new um, event. We, Minister Joseph Harmon, Minister of State, had started these activities in 2016 when we were taking government to the people. We, we have actually covered six regions in the period 2016-2017 and then because of budgetary constraints we had to stop. We have recommenced that, but today's activity is the first uh, it, with this extended version that includes all government ministries and most of the major agencies um, of the government. There has been a persistent complaint that government was inaccessible, that the ministers and the heads of agencies were not responding to the public, they were not meeting people. And so His Excellency the President issued an instruction that we should take government to the people. Today we have all the ministries out here under tents. We have some of the major agencies like uh, the Guyana Water Inc. 
they got the GPL, the National Insurance Scheme, GRA, and there are some entities that are within ministries like the Guyana Police Force, the Discipline Services, Guyana Gold Board, GGMC, they're in their respective ministerial tents. The idea is here, is to get members of the public to come with their issues, with their supporting documents, and we are addressing those issues. We hope as far as possible to address these issues and solve the problems on the spot. Because we have the most senior members of the agencies here. The ministers are here, the permanent secretaries are here, the CEOs of agencies are here, and their support staff. For the people who we cannot see today, it is clear that we have to replicate this in the city and across the country. There's an overwhelming response. We have over a thousand people. We've shared out in excess of 350 tags. We've only seen, we only, we've only processed 150 people so far. It's already midday. So we understand the gravity of the problem. We understand the need for this kind of activity. And we plan to have more of this uh, in a very short time in the future. So we're going to see if we can talk to some of these people, see what it is that they are uh, lining up for, how long they've been waiting, and how long they plan to wait. Tell me your name. What's your name? My name is Green Long. And so tell me, why are you here today? What is it that you expect? I'm here hoping to, hoping to get a house lot. I applied since 2003 and been given the royal runaround. I think this is a good initiative here and I stand a good chance of getting through here today. So I'm happy about getting through today. All right, thanks. All right, good. Tell me your name and what brings you here today? Well, my name is Ishmael. I've applied, I, I, I am married, I have a family. I serve in the Guyana National Service, the Guyana Police Force, the Guyana Defense Force. I've applied 16 years ago. 16 years ago for a piece of land. Go ahead, go ahead, come yeah, In my hands, I got the document. I want to get them in the background. So yeah. Turn around. Since 2000, since 2003, since 2003, I applied. My wife applied 2008. 2008, my wife applied. They called her in for land. When she went to pay, they said it's a mistake. We merge it together. Merge it together. Said we don't want two, three lands. We want one land. As a citizen of this country, and we cannot get a land. Every time we come, the numbers are always finished. Or oh, you got a torn system for 16 years. And only recently they have given land. Only recently they have given land. They have given land to the visual event. As far as I'm concerned, these are just publicity stunts. Publicity stunts. I don't know how long you people are gonna wait for land in this country. They're not a land. The so, Chinese? Yeah. What are your expectations from the meeting today? From the meeting today it turns out to be the same thing. It turns out to be the same thing because no. The numbers would reach the climate to 600 and something. They say they're not given any more numbers. They know that one particular thing. So were you able, are you able to speak with somebody today? I did. And there's nothing they can do. They're saying that um, the ministry could only handle what the ministry could handle. I, 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 I am really upset. So what did you accomplish by coming here today? Makes no nothing. I've missed my job. Because I gotta drive the road to earn money for my family. So every time I come here, it means it's less finance coming into my into my pocket. It's less less finance. It's less. I, I can. I have to pay rent. I have to pay rent. I have to find food for my family. And now I'm taking time off so many times for so many years. You just compile that amount of money, the amount of loss I've already accumulated and accumulated, and I. I and I haven't even given them, get a chance to even get a piece of land. So what, this is the final question, what are your expectations? What do you plan to do? I see there's nothing I really can do. The only thing I can actually do is probably save and through the bank buy my own land. 
because it is useless. This is just a publicity stunt. All right, thank you very much. So guys, there you have it. This is what is happening in Georgetown, Guyana at the meeting of the ministries with the people. I was able to meet with the Ministry of Foreign Affairs and the Ministry of Citizenship. And what I learned today is that the Ministry of Foreign Affairs no longer takes care of remigrant issues. For that, you need to talk to the Ministry of Citizenship. And now, you're only a remigrant in fact, you're a remigrant, you have to file for your remigrant status within six months of entering the country. So those of you planning to return to Guyana, you have six months from the day of arrival to apply for remigrant status at the Ministry of uh, Citizenship located at Shivnarayan Chandrapal Drive in the compound of the, what used to be called the Office of the President, that is the Ministry of the Presidency. If you want to see more content like this, click back and subscribe. In the comments below, tell me what you think about this kind of event. Tell me if you think there are political overtones uh, that make this event necessary and possible now after such a long time. And tell me what you would like to see or what you would like to hear from the ministers or from the ministries in Georgetown, Guyana. As usual, you can support the channel on Patreon and on PayPal. And now there is available merchandise in stores, online where you can purchase uh, souvenirs for Raffel Nation, Raffel Vlogs, and Raffelitos. So, see you in the channel, and see you, see you on this channel next time. Later!